Now, for the finals, three out of five, two stocks, and once again, um, five minutes. Back to the Kalos region, okay. <laughs> Here I'm trying to fucking make sure there's no like random, I mean, there's no like repeating stages, but I'm doing it again. <laughs> Counter projectile, I'm not sure if that's really proud or much. So, so far, without a doubt, Black Mage has the advantage because she's still in the winner's bracket. Puerto Rico, unfortunately, isn't, so he's had a lot of catching up in order to win this one. And he might be fatigued right now because he's been fighting matches like non-stop so far. Come on. Ooh. Oh, no! Black Mage might come out of this one as the winner. I wouldn't be surprised. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> what is that? What is that? Spacing battle, like trying to grab and then a side smash, grab, side smash. What was that all about? And so far, uh, Puerto Rico, you're gonna lose. Maybe not, but oh, okay. If you use your side smash to your advantage, maybe you won. The question is, can you do that? That was a trade. Zella knows how to teleport her way back to stage. Oh, not really much good of a hedgehogger, are they? I mean, they're at the edge, but they're not hedgehogging. Well, he's not hedgehogging enough. Oh. I'm not really liking the looks of this. You got a, a ways to catch up. Oh. oh my god, that could have been a kill. You might be able to get this kill, but can you get the next kill? It'll be impressive if you can. Use your counters! Come on, Puerto Rico, you have them. Use them to your advantage. Make sure you don't like. Oh, oh, that would have been a good time to side smash. What was that? Oh, oh, there we go. There's the counter. It's not enough to kill though. All right, he might come back from this. Not only that, but it, it is possible that he timed this out for a sudden death, or not. You have to remember, guys. When you get back on stage, you still have some invincibility frames. So that, so round one goes to Black Mage. Two more rounds, she wins the tournament. Simple as that. So, yeah, Puerto Rico, you got ways to catch up. All right, Omega, that not bad. The regular stage is just shit though. Two, one, go. All right, come on. Oh. Ah. Okay, so far it's an even match mostly. Black Mace has the advantage though. Oh, Puerto Rico, I'm... I'm honestly scared for your well-being, man. You might not make it out this. That back aerial, man. I mean, that back throw. Really parting stuff. Ooh. Oh! There we go. There we go, Puerto Rico using a side smash to his advantage. Possible. Sometimes, I guess, but not all the time. Give him a 
to clean now. Oh! Marth, you can make it back! I believe in you this time. Maybe not. I don't believe in you that much, but, uh... It's still possible! I don't think it's possible. <laughs> I don't think it anymore, because, like, the thing is... Like, even if your amoeba wins... And... There's a chance that he won't learn any of those actions, and you could like, relearn yours... In order to defeat your amiibo. That doesn't work. The amiibo still learns, even after winning. It learns no matter what, so... It's very possible that your amiibo can just simply kick your butt. And that goes the second round. That's a two stock in a row as well. Like, I'm not sure if Puerto Rico... I don't remember if she uh, got one stock of the last match, but so far, Puerto Rico... For you... To really get back into the tournament scene, you're gonna have to win three times in a row. Otherwise, this is might possibly be the last match in set. So if you lose this one, you're giving Zelda the free win. Alright. Here we go. Three, two, one, go! This is the fight of the century! Begin! Oh. If she uses her Nehru's love, that could Temper! Whoa! Uh, that? Puerto Rico, that was a shitty punish. What was that? Just a dance attack? Could have been like a side smash, another tipper. Something that could deal like a shit ton of damage, but instead you just did a dance attack. Come on, you had a perfect opportunity to stun your enemies, and you took that advantage away. This is no wonder why you might be losing this tournament this time. Oh! Ugh. This might be the end of Puerto Rico. Get the girl down, the hoe down, pop it. Oh! Pop it! Don't do anything to it, unfortunately. Oh! That was getting aggressive now. Like, if she keeps this up, she might be able to just rampage against Puerto Rico. Has she even lost the stock to anyone thus far? Like, I'm not even sure if she lost, like, a single stock whatsoever. Gonna, is it not, not it yet? That is it, ladies and gentlemen. Finishing off with the Din's Fire, the winner of the Amiibo tour, the first ever Amiibo tournament, which is only four participants so far. I don't know. I might be able to get more Amiibos if I can shove the money. Um, considering how each Amiibo is like $13, and I have four Amiibos in total. 13 times 4, that's a total of, if I could do the math correctly, uh, 4 times 12 is 46. Uh, $52! I spent, I shall $52. Technically not even $52 because the Martha Mee was actually more expensive. <laughs> so over $52, um, plus 10, plus 1, $63. I just spent $63 on these Amiibos. Ugh! Just for your entertainment, ladies and gentlemen, I hope it was worth it. And I hope that, um, if you guys really enjoyed this, I might be doing more of these in the future. Next time I do this tournament, I will most likely have 8 Amiibos in total. In total, including our veterans right here. But for now, this is going to be the end of the recording session of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the future of, uh, well, I, I, is this a Let's Play? Because I'm not really playing the game. I'm more watching the fight of commence, but, uh, hey, whatever. Anyways, this is Basinger, signing out.